Let's talk about the issue of uh, the authenticity of the Hadith works. As, as you've mentioned, they were compiled generally a century and a half after the death of the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. So how do we deal with that compared to the Qur'an? Uh, are these, is everything written in the Hadith works uh, authentic, or is there a process to determine what is and what isn't, and um, how, what, what comments would you share about that process? Well, the Qur'an, as I said before, is historically intact, so no one really questions its reliability as a document. Um, the Hadiths are very different because they're not written down during the life of the Prophet, really, in any organized way. So, uh, of course, in the, the, the decades after the Prophet's death, every group that had a certain legal or sectarian or political axe to grind or agenda to pursue would sort of make up hadiths that backed up their cause. So Muslim scholars realized very quickly that the people were forging many hadiths, and they had to try and come up with a way of picking authentic hadiths from, from the forged ones. And they attempted to do this, and they compiled, uh, in, in, for Sunni Muslims, the, the uh, collections of hadith that are considered to be reliable are these six books that I mentioned earlier. Now, um, you know, the, the, the authenticity of the hadith is, is a problem that has never really gone away, and that's why Muslim scholars, you know, although they understand hadiths are very useful and in, in some ways indispensable, they uh, usually think of them as being only probabilistic in their reliability. So, um, your, you know, your faith is never going to be made or broken based on whether or not you accept a certain hadith, because Muslim scholars understood that they could never reach this, or very infrequently could you have a hadith that has the same level of certainty as the Quran. So, uh, you know, this is, Muslim scholars, I think, had a very realistic uh, understanding of the limit of the authenticity of these hadiths.